have a couple of questions. You, here's the first one. You ready? I'm ready. Are you having a good hair day? I'm just joking. No. <laughs> I, I am clearly not. Yes, you are. Clearly not. But yes, I am here, are. and I am engaged. How about that? That's all that matters. <laughs> That's, That's all that matters. How are you doing? All is well? It is. Yeah. Cool. Yes. I'm glad to hear it. Like, we're... This is one of my favorites, yeah. right? Because this is the end. Yeah. This is what we want our students to achieve right yeah. now. And so I think it's important that they know that yeah. from the get-go. <music> our leadership team decides on all of our hashtags on the wall. And so uh, you made Be the inclusive. hashtag. You Be a communicator. You made the hashtag this year, so. I made um, a hashtag. You did for be accountable. <laughs> okay, I like it. Yeah. I like it. That's you awesome. are. You hold us accountable all the well, time. I try. So. But I, I, I want to be. Yeah. A, I want to be a part of the, the solution. <clears throat> One thing that I absolutely love, this is one of our retired teachers that pulls small groups from fifth grade and he does work for EIP. Mm -hmm. And so, you know, last year we just kind of had to make EIP do. This year we built our whole schedule around that and the small group help that they're getting in EIP I think is amazing. Yeah. So, and he has, they love him, like, yeah. he's so good. And he just knows how to break math down right. and make it make sense and I love that. Yeah. And so if you said, Ms. Garvin in fifth grade, are we going to be closer to the mark in fractions and number sense? Yes, yes. it is going to be because we've set them up for success with some of our retired people coming yeah. in. That's so. awesome. Tuesday, so today is our first day of the um, the grant for the vegetables okay. and the fresh fruit and, and the fruit. Yes. Okay. materials came in and gave us two thousand dollars really to do this room in here and our I'm about to go take a nap in our culture climate <laughs> I'm doing. I feel that's like if y'all don't want me to, you'll stop. That's you'll right. say stop, Garvin, and so and then I'll regroup. But yep. until you tell me that, I'm gonna keep going. Keep going. Keep going. <laughs> I'm gonna keep going. keep going, and I'm gonna make these people happy. That's the what last matters. thing that I will say that has been this was a middle of the night idea, um, and we have about 12 um, newborns. Mm -hmm. Literally, I'm walking the car line every day. And I swear, Kim, I'm like, where are these babies coming from? <laughs> you know, but it's a good thing, right? And so I, I told um, one of our teachers, um, she does the little cricket thing, and I was like, I want you to make onesies, future Mustangs. You know, we're going to start, like, delivering to all these babies, right? That'll be cool. I've got 12. I'm not kidding. So <laughs> I've given out five really. so far, but the rest of them are, like, coming on down the line. Yeah. And so, um, anyway, but last Friday, um, two of those parents showed up in the office with the, with the onesies, onesies on with their newborns yep. that were like a week old. I saw it in your social media. And I just love it because yeah. I feel like that's how we impact, yeah. right? Like that's how we tell our story. That's how we keep saying we care about your family. Right. And so um, 
anyway, it's been like they were in tears. And yeah. I was like, thank you, Lord, for the middle of my ideas that I even remembered it, right? <laughs> and so um, anyway, but it's just been really neat because yeah. I feel like, you know, um, you get the whole family yeah. then. Well, that's so, what anyway. it's about. That's anyway. what it's about. Well, We're doing great. Good stuff. Oh, thank you all for coming Good to see by. you. Enjoy the rest of your day. We're going to have a great day. You are. Every day is a great day here. It's because you guys rock your roll out <laughs> here at Moreland Road. We've had an opportunity to visit Moreland Road Elementary School. I want to give a shout out to the students and students and the staff. Thanks so much, Mustangs, for your hospitality and allowing me to see uh, your progress relative to the Leader in Me initiative, as well as spending some time in your Zen room. If you haven't already had a chance to do so, I encourage you to go back and take a look at our first two videos from this series where we visited Rehoboth Road Middle School as well as Carver Road Middle School. I had a great time, had the opportunity to engage with our students, our staff, as well as the principals. I appreciate the effort and the intentionality around ensuring that our students are able to read, write, speak, and solve in every school, in every classroom. That's all for now. Be well.